The 30-meter band is renowned among amateur radio operators for its disciplined and respectful culture, spanning a narrow range from 10.100 megahertz to 10.150 megahertz, it stands apart with its strict mode limitations to CW and digital operations, ensuring a quieter and more focused operating environment. The 30-meter band emphasizes courteous interactions and adherence to traditional amateur radio etiquette. This segment has become a cherished space in the HF spectrum known for meaningful and leisurely exchanges. The 30-meter band owes its existence to the World Administrative Radio Conference of 1979, or WARC-79. Alongside the 17-meter and 12-meter bands, it was introduced as a solution to congestion in existing HF bands. These WARC bands have provided operators with new opportunities for global communications and innovation. The allocation of these frequencies was a landmark in amateur radio history, symbolizing international cooperation and commitment to advancing the hobby. The 30-meter band is unique in its operating restrictions. With focus on narrow band modes like CW and digital, it excludes voice communications entirely. The 30-meter band prohibits contests, reducing high traffic and interference while power restrictions ensure a lower likelihood of disruption to other users. These rules embody the amateur spirit of cooperation and respect, making this band particularly distinct in the HF spectrum. <clears throat> the 30-meter band's unique position in the HF spectrum offers remarkable propagation characteristics. It remains open for communication both day and night, making it versatile and dependable. During the gray line, the periods around sunrise and sunset, signals often travel further and more reliable due to ionospheric enhancements. Stability is a hallmark of this band, ensuring operators can make consistent contacts even during periods of low solar activity. These attributes make the 30-meter band invaluable for DX enthusiasts and casual operators alike. The 30-meter band is cherished for its embodiment of the amateur radio spirit, courteous, skillful, and innovative. Communications here are known for their respectfulness and focus devoid of interruptions the contests often bring. The band has become a proving ground for digital modes, fostering advancements like FT8 and RIDI. By requiring operators to focus on CW and digital communication, the band cultivates technical expertise and reinforces the amateur tradition of continuous learning and respect for others. The 30-meter band presents a unique set of challenges that operators must navigate. Its narrow bandwidth of 50 kHz demands efficient spectrum management and its secondary allocation statuses impose an obligation to avoid interference with primary users like maritime services. Additionally, the physical size of antennas for 30 meters can complicate portable and space-limited operations. Despite these constraints, the band remains a highly valued resource, reflecting the resilience and ingenuity of the amateur radio community. The 30-meter band is popular with SOTA and POTA activities, appealing to operators skilled in CW and digital modes. Its reliable day and night propagation offers an advantage for portable operations, ensuring consistent communication. However, its use is less prevalent compared to bands like 20 meters, partly due to the larger antenna requirements for 30 meters. Despite these challenges, it's a quieter environment and propagation characteristics make it a valuable tool for dedicated operators in outdoor settings. To excel in the 30-meter band, strategic setup and operations are crucial. Compact yet efficient antennas, such as an inverted V or vertical designs, help overcome space constraints. The band's low noise level supports effective low-power or QRP operations, allowing for significant DX contacts without high-power output. Timing is also key. Utilizing gray line propagation during sunrise and sunset maximizes long-distance communications potentials. Mastering these technical aspects ensures successful and rewarding experiences on the 30-meter band. The 30-meter band stands as a testament to the enduring values of amateur radio. Its cultural significance is matched by its technical potential, providing a stable and efficient platform for CW and digital modes. Operators on this band carry forward the tradition of respectful and meaningful communication, contributing to the innovation and experimentation. As technology evolves, the 30-meter band remains a cherished part of the amateur spectrum, highlighting the spirit of the community and the endless possibilities it offers.